Yo everybody, what's going on? Klaus here, welcome back to more Let's Play Shantae and the Pirate's Curse. Last episode, we went to the, um, Spinland Palace to get the Forbidden Mask for Alice to come here to Saliva Island. This episode, well, we're gonna be exploring Side Island. Alright, let's do this. Let's stalk the ship. This is it, Saliva Island. As we can find it on the map, this is the end of the line. <laughs> I'm ready for any anything. That bandana looks great on you, Shante. Awesome! Where'd you get those clothes? Hello, Dick. It's all kinds of fun stuff to wear. Most of the clothes were too roomy, though. Stay away from my personal effects! Gosh, I've never been so far from the mainland. It's pretty here. Don't be deceived. The pirate master draws power from this place. There's a den of evil hidden somewhere in this island. You're going to find it. What about you? You're not coming? Not this time. But I'm sure if we work together... I said no and I meant it. I have my reasons. Okay, whatever. Oh! Being called out. How dare you! I'll get you like a mackerel! Uh, how can you do that if you're unarmed? Sheesh, learn to take a joke. Yeah, seriously. Get out of that silly outfit! Hmm. That ain't no fun. Rep to go! Nope. No, you're not. Okay. So, the... Oh, right, I didn't try it. These... Okay. Go through here. God, I love this music. This, this game has some of my favorite soundtracks. This is a little... Uh, these, um, frog things, and... Yeah. Looks like these mermaids here will, um, part the fire from the two projectiles to do this. I, I like, but also just like risky things for that. And he, he takes everything too seriously. I mean, I understand this is a pirate, of course, and... You know, like, terror in the seven seas and all that. And then, like, unless he is, like, super serious, he can't be taken seriously, but, seriously, he kind of learns to get up, man. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, we don't necessarily have to focus on all of his enemies, but I want the gym. Okay, okay now that that is done... And down here, there's another switch that we can't activate quite yet, so we're going to ignore that. And... Wow, what happened here? Many years ago I came to this island of my beloved bride-to-be. Our only wish was to be joined in holy matrimony. But a whole monster, a servant of the pirate master, found us. He gazed into my he uh, His gaze turned my beloved to stone. So, basically, he's Medusa. Ugh, I can never leave her side. Here, I take the strings so I can finally forget my sorrows. That's pretty sad, actually. Yeah, it does look kind of old. I just like that, man. <laughs> okay, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay, that ring, we... You actually need it like that, which is why I went down here. Alright, I I am a platforming idiot. Oh. And... The need who just stands on does nothing. Okay, that ring is actually useful right here. That's all this circular indica indication here. Yep, this is where the ring goes. And now we can actually get these gentlemen statues to rise. 
you know, actually has some platforms on there, but first, I'm gonna head it over here. Ignore that save guy. And talk to the... Hey girl, cute get up. You, you here for a swim break? Huh? Us too. Look at this plane swimming hole. It's all dry up. Can't Sunday without a barber pool. <laughs> this place is a total rip off. Yeah, swim. Might as well eat. I got the ham all set up. Cool, no water from the chain. Yes, you do need a talk to each other. I felt tough. I'll press the manager. Because if you rip this ham a lot. Huh, ham a lot. And it sucks up, it sucks up this ham stink. <laughs> but I like the ham stink. Believe it or not, this is actually needed. Well, we'll get into that a bit later. For now, we need to hit the hit these statues in this visual order. That one, that one. Four, three, one, two. Because this statue will be the will be the first to go down. You have a limited time to get across the uh, uh, get across this cab up to this ledge up here. So uh, frog here and okay. If there's like a waterfall going down here, like going to the ground, how could that swimming place dry up? I guess because maybe there's some um, a particular bar store that stops. Oh, okay. Now I need real, I need to be really careful here. Because uh, I didn't want to quite use that auto punch. How's that on my bad playing or is that playing? Maybe both. But I, I do, I do love the water. The water falls. You just take it down for no reason because I'm a jerk of a half meaning, yeah. A jerk of a half meaning can't dodge stuff worth it. Yeah. That's awesome. Also, it's gonna kind of follow this arrow just so I can show it. That's not anything like we can interact with. The uh, arrow is a lie! The arrow is a liar! Never listen to this! Forge! They lie! Their population is known to be liars! Okay. <laughs> I have to. Alright, oh, check this time though. It's a Giga Lamox. Oh, this thing's enormous. What's the sign say? Caution. Giga Limax may become aroused by a traveler smelling of ham. This is what we need the ham thing for. Smell the ham. You are becoming hungry. Yeah, that's. But before we go over there, the curse talk that we're here that we're, that we're gonna wanna make up. Okay. Check it down real quick. There we go. Thank you. Your dark magic is mine. Sweet. Kind of trapped inside the land. That's the should be a third one actually. Yes, Geronimo! Come back to that later. Hey girl, you got the water turned on. It's in the pool. You said it, girlfriend. Ah. Yeah. What's this? My personal body for skin is too for the sun. I too. I just don't think off. Everyone not to. Cross the beam. Characters, light up. 
And we got the Petrified Spell. He did it! The pool's full again! It smells like asphalt. Carter is really, really dormant. In a business. I wonder why! Haha. <laughs> Alright. Petrified Spell is under... Because yeah, petrification spell for steel. I ancient ruins. Uh, do I want to give this? All right, I'm, <clears throat> I'm gonna take the time to save right now. Try a lobster tail, but I maybe come to hear those things. Alright, we're, we're not we're not here talking. About, we're here to talk about the game. Uh, yeah. You found something. <gasps> Could it be? You found it. The spell that uh, turned my blood to stone. Last, I can I can find uh, at long last I can finally reverse this effect. Hush, my beloved, when I speak the sacred words, <clears throat> petrify. You ended up turning yourself to stone. Wow. What? And... Hey, whoopsie is right. Let's fall down the hole. Shall they fall down the hole? Alright, spit town base. This is actually... ...an important area, if I gotta say, for... ...being an underground ruin. Okay, so he's kind of got Here we have some of these snakes. We don't have to take down, but we can. This is a really good area if you want to go and grind up some gems, because these enemies will just keep spawning from, the, from this hole, so. It's all, not only can you get a, a few monster milks and some um, flesh pops. But it's it's a it's a really good area if you want to like grind up a lot of gems. I'm I'm probably gonna use that quite a bit as there are some stuff I'm gonna need to get from the uh, from ye old shop. Go down here, over here, heart squid. Like I said, some of these um, heart squids are really 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 easy to get to. Last of our time players aren't too familiar with false wall and like you just go through it and pass through walls and stuff. It's just pretty it's just pretty cool for like kind of secrets. Like this. A spit out maze map. Now I'm just gonna bring this up here. Yeah. This shows you the um, entirety uh, the entirety of the place that you're going to, that you're going. Through. Which it, it's it's kind of cool, but some of the maps of some for, for some of these dungeons are I'd say for like a better term in kind of some locations. And yeah, there's uh, yeah another heart squid. Sorry, they're just really just handing them out. Uh, they're, they're just handing them out like candy at this point. This, this is pretty cool, I guess, eh? Oh! Well, of course. I prayed something and that happens to me. 
Yes, anywhere you can fall, and that'll actually harm you. That's marked by these skulls. Skull and crossbones, exactly. How appropriate thing for a game that's focusing on pirates. Okay, this guy. You, hey, you gotta wait till you can dash the cross before you can effectively hit him. Jump and he's dashing. Never mind. There you go. We got a, um, princess finding a key. Use it to open a locked door. Key! I didn't know that's what a key does! Get used to this, by the way, whenever you pick up a key. Expect that. Yeah, get used to it coming up every time. Is it, is it kind of annoying? Yeah, it is. But hey, what do you do? That's one thing I will kind of say I kind of don't like about this game is like whenever you, whenever you pick up a key anytime it'll tell you what it does. I think it's too bad that- oh. You out. Wait, that part switch down there? Just crawl into here. There you go. Stuff is how easy. Just how easy it can be. It's easy. <laughs> it's, it's We're here. Oh my God! We can't go through any further unless we can shoot. Unless we can hit that from a distance. How can we possibly do that? <laughs> okay. Enough of me making a um, no dramatic tension out of this. This cage? Oh my god, it was attached to weak chains! Yeah. Yeah, okay, that was dumb. Alright. There you go. Just gonna get past these. I'm really low on health, and I don't have any auto cards in the box. Haze, get a fire, and fall through this like in path right here. Okay, and in here, I'll show you the um. Actually, um. No, I'll hang on to that. Cuz we got Risky's pistol. Press A to shoot enemies and switches. Yes, now yes, we can now attack from from a distance. Uh, I I I think of um. I like to think of using the uh, pistol as um. Pulling a, a, a pulling a metro here. I don't know why. I, I just do. Tell me we're in that aspect, but yeah, that's that's just how I think of this. Okay. Let the switch and you go across here. And hey, I don't know. It's, it's something that doesn't quite get me. Can't go through that wall normally, but maybe if we're in this cage, we can go through just fine. Yeah. How that entirely makes sense to me? Uh, no, it doesn't make sense. I just made more logic. <laughs> I'm running into the logic or anything. It's it's also kind of weird because the cage itself is solid mass. Oh well. They could go to the hidden wall. But I would just want to smash with these pots. Maybe get a recovery heart. Get some gems. Oh, I guess. And as we all know, they said, Pottery is our enemy. Okay, you can really hit either or switch to get us from this wall here. I just like jumping. And hitting that gear switch with this. 
I don't know why, I just... I always like doing that. Go against... COD MODE! It's like going against the game you know, and getting where I can. Or in areas I can actually get away with it. We should be near the... that kind of evil here. Hopefully look at the map, we are getting close. Yeah, that is always good. Except if you kill. Uh. Whereas, the public, whereas the public shield is good, it won't protect you from physical attacks. So it's not overpowered in it. Uh, not one of those overpowered sets where it makes you invincible. Oh, Mick Junklet, you couldn't have come at a better time. Alright, there we go. Okay, now I'm gonna show off the, um, Monster Milk. What this does is double your attack power. Especially useful when coming here to fight. It's a room like this where you gotta fight, fight, fight off a couple of things like this. Where an area colorizing the area. So they pass that gauntlet. Usually, when they're e usually there's a um, a small tiny little room where you have to fight like um, it's simple enemies and everything. Every, 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 so yeah, uh, right into the town, I guess. Okay, collect these hearts. There's always a save point before the de the end of you. Just you know, we're gonna use that right now. Sword and we are at the first end of evil. Let's take on the evil inside. Cyclops Black! Alright, Cyclops Plant. Cyclops Plant is fairly easy to do it. You have these eye plants that I'll pop up. Uh, okay, at first they're gonna be close enough for you to put your hair. Okay, that's where you can do That's where you can do You'll spawn these slimes. Really aren't a good deal, but yeah. After a while, attacking the thing, you're gonna want to shoot the thing. Off, you're gonna want to shoot those eyes off of it. Uh, <coughs> I can't believe I just died by that. Well, you got well, you got to see a proper death in this game. Yeah, that's, yeah. Cyclops plant isn't done yet. It's reduced to just an eyeball. Okay. But it stop bouncing around like a pinball. What you want to do is just keep ripping it into shape. Yeah. But it, when it's reduced to, to just an eyeball, it's really a joke. Because it sucks to dodge it massively into fire. And just stay on the opposite side of the screen that it is currently bouncing towards. If you keep if you keep this in mind, he won't be able to hit you at all. In fact, he's done. Uh, it's humiliating that I actually died. Uh, A freaking easy boss fight. Tinker bats. Yeah, there's a tinker back here. Get back here, you! He dropped the uh, map in the heat of the moment. And we got the map to Spider Rip Isle. Oh yeah! I did it! Power Master won't be able to draw power from this place anymore. I better go tell Risky. 
But before I do that, I'm going to activate the switch. If I can actually hit it, there we go. Pick up our next heart squid! Very, very nice. Alright. This will also serve as a nice little shortcut back to the fire ship. Which is all good name. But, we better show Risky, Risky that we got the map. He has only two good street time. Found something. An evil dungeon and a giant monster and... Where did you get that pistol? Found it locked up in a chest. Why? Never mind. Anything else? Yes, I the map. One of your Tinker Bats dropped it. He hadn't transformed yet. Interesting. I suggest that the Pirate Master doesn't have enough dark magic to go around. Which means you still have time to prevent, to prevent his return. Lime aboard! We're off to the next island. We can go to... Pirate Island! Which, we're gonna save our departure to, um, Spider of Island for the next episode. Now, as you can see, this reconstruction of this place has already begun. Like, some of these workers are hammering away in this place. Yeah. yeah. Done. Hey, um, yes? Yes, I'm disgusted by the palace. Please follow me. Okay. Perhaps you're aware that Sultana is way on business. For such formal inquiry, the recent actions. The interaction is not possible. No? Of course, very old. And legal. Guidelines. Responsibility falls to the royal liberty. Because apparently he once served compared on the early council. But one day, he has deemed it inappropriate to cut in some long hair. Do I say? Haha! Uh, I love just how a goat mouth can cut hair. It's pretty dumb. Okay, that was close. Oh no, you're not getting up that easy. What's I hear about you sneaking off the library? Oh, yeah. Uh, I still say you told me to stay out of trouble, did I not? Yes, sir. Next time, I might not be so lucky. I want to ask you. Uncle. Yes. Um, no. never mind. Alright, I'll be back in my merchant. Please your mind. That's, uh, I have a letter sent to the park that requires my immediate attention. Okay, all that is said and done. Next time, let's play Shantae and the Pirates Girls. We'll be heading off to Spider Rib Island in search of our next den of evil. Evil! Okay, I can. See you guys next.